No, I swear to God, it's the tan, okay? I have taken a shower today. Oh, hi. So I'm guessing everyone knows what this is. It's a turtle. But more than that, it's a Rubik's Cube. Now, the sole purpose of a Rubik's Cube is to fuck with your head. Now, I don't know how many of you have actually solved a Rubik's Cube before, but I haven't. So guess what we're gonna do today? Hopefully something a lot more interesting than solving a Rubik's Cube. Well, I mean, I, I think that's interesting. <laughs> oh god, you fail. But I want to, I've never finished it. I really want to solve the- Oh, just solve your freaking sphere already! It's actually a cube. <laughs> Same thing. And you should know this, but Dan Brown, aka Pogo Bat, is one of the best people at this. And his YouTube video that shows how to solve a Rubik's Cube has won awards, and it's like one of the most viewed videos ever, so I'm going to use that to solve this today. So I'll, I'll probably fail, but we'll see. So. Yeah, Dan Brown, okay. Hey world, my name is Dan Brown, and I'm here to teach you how to solve one of society's modern day mysteries. Erno Rubik's Magic Puzzle Cube is something that has frustrated millions of people since its release in 1980. If you want to solve Rubik's Cube without memorizing everything, twist the top layer 45 degrees, put your finger in here, or something else if it's in, rearrange it so that it's solved. Really? I think mine is broken. I can't do that! Okay, I, I guess we'll just have to do it the hard way. You begin learning how to solve it. Now, in learning how to solve it, you have to learn what are called algorithms. While it sounds fancy, then the cube will go back to its original position. There was one. This side is the green side because the centerpiece is green. I don't have no to... way that you move the cube can change. And then swing this around to the white side right there. Occasionally, you'll find yourself in a position like this. Desperation leaves me overjoyed With fading lights that lead us past the lives that we destroy ah! Yay, I did the first side. And this took more than it should have. The reason I'm not recording it is because it takes too long and my camera is running out of battery. So I'm just gonna, you know, show you stuff as I progress with it. If I progress with it, I might not, so yeah. About two hours later, um, I finally decided that I was going to give up. But I finished it! I'm sorry I didn't record it, but it was just like, it took me so freaking long, and it was so frustrating that all you would have seen were just like, <laughs> which would not have been such a nice thing to see. But it is finished, it is lucky, and it's, yeah, it's turtles and then there's a bunny rabbit. But please, please never ever ask me to do this ever again. I'm just gonna put it on my head because that's where it belongs because, no but really, it's freaking hard, like it's frustrating to try and solve it. You try and solve it and see how frustrated you get. So yeah, tell me if you've ever solved this. How long did it take you? Did you look at instructions? Did you do it yourself? Did you give up and just throw it out the window and be like, fuck off? Or are you just a genius and you solved this in like two minutes? Now I'm just gonna go celebrate by doing nothing. Like, nothing that actually requires my brain to function. Bye!